Okay, uh, I'm at the stage now where I've um, I've made the split clamp that clamps round partially round the bottom and the top of the of the quill, and um, it works very well. Um, uh, you move it up and down; it, it it runs fine, and then you just give this. A little, just a little nip, and everything's locked up. So um, that's really working very nice. I put a spring in between the two halves, so that it it the spring helps to separate the two halves when you undo. Um, so that's that. Um, I've now got myself a piece of brass, and um, I've. Um, I've machined it down, I, I put it on a long bar because I didn't want to cut off and waste any so I put it on a long bar and supported it, centered it with the with the ordinary um, uh, tailstock, the original tailstock because this was too far forward and um, and then I uh, put the uh, the new tailstock on and um, located the center with this uh, revolving center and machined it down in that area and then applied a knurl with uh, uh, this knurling tool that I made um, that was scaled down from full size to three quarter uh, and it's a, um, a copy of one of the um, knurling tools in I think it's Hemingway so um, it really really works nicely it has this nice cam on it where you can increase the feed or the pressure you can increase the, the pressure just uh, only a certain amount but just enough to to get it to to dig in and, and get some meat in between the knolls so that works very well I'm now at the stage where um, I'm going to um, I'm going to part this off now, and um, uh, I'm going to bore the this end so that it fits over this over this. Um, let's see, get that up there. Uh, so that it fits on this screw, that's a uh, 832 um, and um, so that should be a nice a nice uh, knob for there, it won't interfere with this and if I do decide to make this a big bigger in diameter make a new one then it still won't interfere with the the, uh, the clamp so that's that's where I've got so far um, everything works nicely still a bit tight there but that's okay and and this works beautifully um, just really really nice so I'm really pleased with it I think it's going to be a real nice addition to the the original design of the lathe okay <laughs> 